Yo, what is up guys? It's Ben here, just chilling with my squids. Oh yeah. And welcome to another Minecraft tutorial. Now today I'll be showing you guys how to set a timer or a stopwatch in Minecraft using command blocks. Now this video is step by step so it should be fairly easy to follow and I'll have all the commands down in the description so you can just copy paste them into your command blocks. So uh, see you over there and uh, yeah, enjoy the video! So before we touch any command blocks we got to type in three things in chat. So the first one being scoreboard objectives add timing with a capital dummy and then timing again that's gonna add timing to the system then you want to do the same thing but this time with the word with the word uh, time so add time dummy time and there you go now one more thing you want to type in whoops not game mode scoreboard objectives set display sidebar did I write that right? no I did not sidebar you gotta make sure everything's written properly or else nothing will work so uh, you gotta be careful with that so time and yeah that's it so um, that's all you gotta type in chat then the next thing you wanna do is the commands and the command blocks so the time starter is gonna be scoreboard players set at nearest player it has to be P it can't be A uh, or R it has to be P then timing with a capital and then one so that starts the timer and then to stop the timer it's the same command except with a zero at the end then to reset in your sidebar you got to type in scoreboard players reset at P again not an A and then for the looper or the uh, command block that adds time every second is scoreboard players add at everybody this one has to be A uh, brackets, no space, I think. I don't know if it's called a bracket or not. Uh, you can correct me down in the comments. But this little sign here, score, underscore, timing, with a capital again, underscore, M-I-N, equals one, and then close your bracket. And then space, time, with a capital, and one. Uh, and then for the loop, this is a one-second loop. I'll show you how to build it right here. Take, whoops. Take two blocks like this, and then another, whoops, another block right here repeater on three delay I think it's three delay and then repeater here whoops repeater here with two tick delay some redstone here and a torch that's gonna do your one second delay and then you can branch off to the side and then have uh, your command block with the command inside of it so um yeah that's pretty much it for the uh, command so now let's test it out so I'm going to start the time here. As you can see on the right, it says time and then Benjami for me. Uh, because I pressed the button, if it were to be uh, A, everybody would have the time starting. But in this case, it's just me because it's a P. Then let's stop the time. It stops at 10 and then reset the sidebar. So uh, if you don't want the commands to show up in chat like that, what you want to do is go to Options, Multiplayer Settings, uh, go to Scale, Off, and then test it again. The sidebar should stay there. So yeah, the, the sidebar, my bad, stays there, but the chat doesn't show up, and then boom. So I'm just going to set up a demonstration real quick on how this system can be used, and uh, I'll be right back. So I set up a little parkour demonstration right here uh, with a couple buttons. So let's, uh, let's test out. Timer should start. Yep, starting two, three, four, five, six, and then boom, timer stops. Uh, should have stopped at 7, but it stopped at 6 because it's like a millisecond precise type of deal. Then press here, boom, respawn, or not respawn, but teleport here. Press the reset button, and it stops. So uh, if you guys enjoyed the video and would like to see more, please make sure to hit the like button, subscribe, uh, and I'll see you guys all in the next video.